Hi, my name is JP. I'm in San Francisco, and in 203 days, I'm going to be traveling the world. And I'm here today with my friend Matt. Hi. And we are going to check out the Chinese New Year Parade. It's one of the biggest Chinese New Year parades outside of Asia. I think it's the biggest, actually, outside of Asia. And Matt's never been. Nope, this is the first time. Yeah, so uh, we're going to check it out and uh, maybe check out some other Chinatown things along the way. Bye. San Francisco's large Asian population has been celebrating Chinese New Year for over a month now. On the day of the parade, Chinatown is bustling with tourists and locals alike. And the Chinatown community is out in full force. So I used to come to Chinatown all the time um, because my dad would take me because he wanted to eat Chinese food. <laughs> uh, and I always expected to like find like really cool stuff here uh, when I was a kid. And sometimes I'd find some toys, but uh, I was always disappointed coming to Chinatown. Uh, and I'm sure most people who come to Chinatown are disappointed. Do you like Chinatown? I do, it's fun. I'm not the biggest fan in the world, but it's very festive right now. Does that make you want to drink more Coke? Yeah, actually, it kind of sounds... Okay. Vendors set up shop in booths on the street, selling their wares and offering games to promote their products. Okay, yeah, he's up. Okay, and live music can be heard on every street corner, ranging from traditional Chinese to American pop covers. So Matt and I were walking um, around and look who I ran into, another vlogger. I'm Jordan. His name's Jordan. And uh, we actually have the same camera. Same camera. He's working on some journalism stuff right now. He's documenting the parade. And, uh, wow. And their fireworks. Uh, yeah, and uh, Jordan is going to be starting his own YouTube channel soon. That's great. Uh, we don't know what it's going to be called yet, but uh, um, it's most likely going to be called J B Bangin, J A Y B E B A N G I N. Bloop. So go Coming check it soon. out. Go check it out. I'll put in the links below when he gets his uh, channel up. Yay! All right. Good luck to nice both to of us. You. Okay, we're done with Chinatown, and we're heading over to check out the preparations for the parade. For these performers, this is their chance to showcase their heritage and their talents. Over 3 million spectators and television viewers at home will be watching. And with all this attention, the parade sponsors are also getting in on the action. We're at Starbucks right now. The line's really ridiculous. Um, Matt has a caffeine addiction. Yeah, we're, we have to feed it. Otherwise, it's gonna be grumpy. So, yeah, but the parade's right up there. The San Francisco Chinese New Year Parade is the biggest Chinese cultural celebration outside of Asia. Since the California Gold Rush, the parade has captivated audiences and provides a glimpse of Chinese culture to Western spectators. The parade brings together musicians, dancers, and performers from San Francisco, the Bay Area, and beyond. The parade also highlights the diversity of San Francisco, It's truly a celebration of San Francisco pride and offers representation from a broad range of American and Asian traditions. Schools and youth groups have a strong showing at this parade, especially as bilingual education in the Bay Area is becoming more prominent 
It allows these youngsters the opportunity to perform and build their confidence, to appreciate their cultural heritage, and to make their parents proud. Float's sporting corporate brands are also very apparent here. And we can't forget the pageantry of Miss Chinatown USA and her royal court. But at the heart of this parade are symbols and iconography of a rich cultural tradition. From lion dancers, to fireworks, to the animals of the zodiac. Thousands of Chinese immigrants have sought new life in San Francisco. This parade exists as a testament to the impact they've had on this city. As the parade concludes, audiences are awed by a 268-foot golden dragon, ushering in the new lunar calendar year. Okay, so that's it guys. That was the Chinese New Year Parade. Thank you, Matt, for coming with me. Of course. Thank you so much for joining us. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below to see more videos. Um, let me know in the comments below, how do you celebrate Chinese New Year, if you do celebrate Chinese New Year? And if you don't, do you know what your zodiac is? What's your zodiac? <laughs> it's a horse. <laughs> uh, yeah, he just learned that today. All right, uh, well, thank you so much. And uh, until next week, Get off the couch and go do great things. Bye! Create content that's, that's fun and enjoyable, but it's also um, honest and uh, not gimmicky and not pretentious. So uh, that's why I kind of decided to take a walk and uh, do this a little vlog style. Um, and I hope, hopefully it pays off. Uh, sunlight.